Yeah, all right. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Hi. Thank you so much for listening to the Stories and Co. podcast. This is a series I like to call the Never Again series, where we'll just talk about... One more time, one more time, one more time. Never Again series, say it one more time. This is the Never Again series. Yes. What was that for? Okay, um, where we talk about things that we never do again. So today I have a very special guest here, Daniel from the Diploma in Communications and Media Management. Yeah, interesting. That's a really fun course, I assume. Mm, wow. Very. That's great. That's great. Okay, so today's topic, I think you're familiar with it. Do you know what we're going to talk about today? HBL. Oh, yes. Yes. I yeah. personally would like to call it HB Hell, but I guess that works. So, um, HBL. Let's start from the top. Yeah, let's go. What was the initial impressions when you found out that like, we're going to do HBL? The first thought of HBL was just draining. That was just my first initial thought of it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because you must remember, mm-hmm. we just yeah. graduated from secondary school. Oh, we are first year poly students, you see. Mm, we expect to go to campus wearing this type of clothes, Ooh. no more uniforms. Yeah. But then, toop, 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 home-based learning. Or what, what would you like to call it? Home-based what? I guess HB Hell. HB Hell, I yes. see. Yeah. How about you? Um, okay, so since I was from PFP, right, so I knew what campus life was like. Then, um, when I heard that we're doing like HBL, I was kind of like excited because it's like, oh, okay, you study at home, then don't have to come to school and don't have to spend money. Isn't that like, like that's like goals, you know? I felt like, oh, at online school, I could like, you know, live all those rich people's lives, you know? Like what it's like to be an online school person. Well, um, all that was, um, well, a reality that never happened. Uh, HBL. So was... I can say that when they announced that it's going to be HBL, mm-hmm. you were kind of excited for it. Uh? Yes, I was like extremely excited. I was like, yes, stay at home, on. Yeah, okay, then reality sinks in. So, what was like the reality of HBL for you? Okay, let me just give them a context of it. We were from the same class. Mm-hmm. Okay? Yes, we so, we had, we, were, we had to go back to school, I think, before the semester starts for a briefing. Mm-hmm. Briefing for HBL, right? Mm-hmm. So I saw him, but then me being an introvert, mm. I didn't want to talk to anyone. So my initial uh, expression was just like that. He was being an extrovert, getting to know everyone, right? Of course, of course. So keep that in mind, whereby in class, we don't talk. Mm. Now it's at home, HBL. Mm-hmm. Do you think we will talk? What was the answer? No. No. We won't talk. Hmm. Yeah. Really sad, really sad. Mm-hmm. Sad? Yeah, really sad. Yeah, it was really sad. Because I didn't really get to interact with anybody in like the first semester. I didn't really make friends in the first semester. Yeah, sure. Until like towards the end when they allowed us to like come back to school. For face-to-face for lessons. For face-to-face, the like, econs. Yeah, yeah the first... for alternate weeks, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah the econs thing. Yeah, I remember the first thing that you came to me. Yeah. First, the first conversation I had with my best friend here, Daniel. He asked me, Hey bro, you know where's the toilet? Oh, yes. Wow, that was really a new introverts. Part. You feel me, right? <laughs> that was really like the breaking. Like it was a new part of our friendship, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, do you personally like HBR? Hmm. I guess it's a mixture of yes and no. I guess. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Why? As an introvert, I don't need to show my face. Mm-hmm. Okay. But no, so I have to show my face when the teacher calls, Daniel, can you please answer this question? Daniel, can you please answer this question? And there's two Daniels in the class. You want get, to get to that? You want to get to that? Mm, yes, please, please explain more. Uh, okay, there's another Daniel in class. His name is uh, Daniel. Uh, <laughs> our Dan. best friend. Yes, Dan, yeah. Our current radioactive um, music director. Music director. Mm-hmm. An extrovert like you, uh-huh, mm-hmm. he was my only friend throughout Sam 1. Wow, yes. okay. And I was quite happy with that, you know. Wow. As an extrovert, eh, as an introvert, mm-hmm. um, lesser friends equals to more freedom and, and more mm. energy conserve, I guess. Oh, yeah. I so for me, HBL was kind of interesting. Mm-hmm. Stay at home. But, 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 discipline. 
must have discipline. <laughs> and as for this guy, there's no discipline. Mm. So if I were to turn off my camera, the next thing was just phone, PUBG, Instagram, TikTok. Uh -huh. Yeah, that screen <laughs> is just a second thought. Yeah, the first thought will be this. This yeah. is the focus. Yes. Right. Then how about you, Mr. Shabil? How? What do you mm. think of HBL? Okay, at first, I was really motivated, you know, I was like, coming from PFP, I was like, you know what, this is my 4.0 semester. 4.0? Yeah, wow. I was like, I was ready, I was wow. like, this, this Sam 4.0, okay? Yeah, so I was motivated at the start, then after that, I started getting addicted to TikTok. Yeah, and then I started... It's quite familiar. Yeah, like, we, we kind of we, we the same, you yeah. know? Yeah. So like, yeah, I got addicted to like TikTok, and then I started stop, I like, I still participated a lot in like okay. during HBL. I yeah. think like if you were he from my partic class, participated a lot. Yeah, like yeah. like when people were saying like one thing they hated about each classmate, people said that I talk too much. Like excuse <laughs> me. Yeah. We don't want to be naming any names here. Yeah, we're not here, naming but, any yeah. names. Yeah, but I think she's like part of the CCA. Yeah. If you know, you know, <laughs> right? You know, you yeah. Know. Yeah. So then after that, like towards like the middle part of the HBL journey. That was when like things started going down, where I started missing assignments. Mm. I started like not really caring about school, and then like a lot of like I didn't really understand a lot of the assignments. Yeah, yeah. Like one weird thing was that I came in thinking that journalism was gonna be my subject, but in reality, it's actually my worst subject. So mm. yeah, HPL was not that great for me. Yeah, that's why I hate it. So but much. as compared to face-to-face -face lessons, if I were to give you a choice, you Shabil choose either face-to-face -face or HBL. Definitely face to face. Face to face. Why? Because you get to you get to meet your friends, mm -hmm. and then if you have anything like you don't understand, mm. right? You can get you can just go straight to the teacher and be like, "Chill, what's wrong with my work?" Instead of like waiting for the teacher to answer. Yeah. Then let's say you have a deadline, right? Then you're like dead. If let's say she doesn't answer on time, you're dead. You're screwed. Zero percent. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, like, to be honest, in Sam 1 also, the whole class was not close to each other, right? Mm, yeah, that's yeah. why. You cannot ask your friends. Yeah. So, like, face-to-face, -face, you actually, like, meet people. You don't understand anything. So, yeah, even true. if you're not that close to that classmate, you can still go to them and still talk to them. You know what I mean? Yeah. But then there are perks of HBL. Like, you don't need to travel to school. Mm. You just stay at home. Mm -hmm. Own comfort, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, like, like what it was... I don't know whether if it, it's a myth or what, but you wake up, like, five minutes <laughs> before lesson. I don't know, but yeah. I think some people do that. I still, mm. I still wake up at 4.30 a.m. before, yeah. 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 Shabil wakes up at 4.30 a.m. and sleeps at 8. Yeah, fun fact, fun fact you guys. Yeah, mm. I sleep at 8.30, wake up at 4.30, HBL, no HBL, same thing. Same, same thing? Routine. 4.30? Yes, 4.30. 4.30, I guys. was sleep at 5 hours Get that in mind, 4.30, guys. Okay. 5 hours before class, I really, really. Mm. That's, that's the model student right there. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, but submit work 27 hours after deadline. Yes. But still, I was there for class. 4 point? Oh. <laughs> Wishing to get 4 That's point. the goal lah. That's that the goal, right? That was the goal. We don't, yeah. we don't reach it, but that was the, the goal. goal. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So, hmm. Like, what was your least favorite subject? Like, HBL. Like, for HBL, this subject really like CMI. I hated it for HBL. Okay. Uh, for me, Okay, to be honest, like, I think it's it was BTA. BTA. Yeah. Because okay, BTA was <laughs> it's a mixture of HBL and face to face, mm, correct? Yes. But then to do BTA at home, it's quite diff mm. this, this is just different. Okay? The new functions and all. Yeah. I remember one time I had to video call you, right? Yeah. To, <laughs> to help me with my yeah. BTA. Yeah. Yeah. Then I was just stuck there. I then I was like, who, who, mm, hmm, mm. 4.0, 4.0, Shabil, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Shabil is the guy. Mm. So I had to be the call Shabil, I had to call Shabil, mm. ask him, Shabil, how do I do this? Shabil, how do I do that? Mm. And definitely Shabil has the answer. Of course, so, of course. Okay, in his Of course. <laughs> of course. Okay, in his defense, the chair was like really like she was really going the long way to accomplish like one easy task. Like if let's say you just read the instructions, you'd finish it in like 15 minutes. But if you follow that teacher, she will not be named. If you follow her... But we will name her. No, the next podcast. <laughs> the next podcast will name her. But right now, we won't name her. So, yeah, she would take like literally an hour to complete that one small exercise, which I didn't really get because I was like, you can finish this in 15 minutes. What's going on? Yeah, so that... I get it. I get why yeah. you were confused. Makes but sense. But that's Shabir, right, for a reason. Yeah, of course. So of we course. can ask Shabir like, anything. Yeah. 4.0, am I right? Uh, wishing. Wishing. Wishing, okay. The goal is there, okay? 
1.0, the goal can still be wishing for 4.0. Yeah. yeah? Okay. Um, personally, for me, the subject that I really hated, like, for HBL was SNW. <laughs> This is very weird because yeah, like, I have my part to say on that, right? Yeah. Carry on, carry on. This was very weird because like in PFP, I actually hated SNW. Mm. But the fact that I had to do it at home now and we had like things to do, I, I couldn't be bothered. You know, like you yeah. know, there was still like a good portion of people who were at risk actually. of failing SNW. Like yes. since when was that even a thing? Who actually was like, you know, when they went to poly, like, oh my god, I'm so scared that I'm gonna fail. SNW. SNW yeah. yeah, that was never heard of before HBL. And, you know, like, playing, like, in SNW itself, right, was so much fun because you actually get to, like, bond with your yeah. classmates. It's just two hours of you just playing, like, some dumb games. It's the interaction that, yeah, that, yeah, that makes the, bond, yeah. the experience. Yeah. I mean, yeah. how are you going to do SNW at home with your friends? There's no way. Oh my god, yes. Uh, what? Kahoot. Yeah, sure. Kahoot. <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Kahoot. Kahoot. Okay, so what do you have to say about SNW, huh? Hmm? <laughs> what do you have to say? Okay. I'm very disappointed, like, actually. Mm. It's very sad for me to have SNW at home. Because mm -hmm. I was looking forward to have SNW in school. Mm -hmm. To play maybe either soccer, volleyball, any any sports, lah, basically. Mm -hmm. And then, I see SNW as a subject that can that can be born like mm, classmates yes. furthermore like we never talk to each other for the mm -hmm. whole sem mm -hmm. you see yes. so having that face to face would be very good lah right mm -hmm. it's, it just serves as a platform for us to you know communicate with each other get to know one another better mm -hmm. but then sadly it was in our first sem so first sem was HBL so we had to do I think there were a few exercises that we had to do at home right mm, I think yes. it was sit up push up I think I did. I don't you did? remember. No? I, I did not. Oh, I, I did. Not the, I, oh, did, did, I did. Yes, I did. Ah, okay. Uh, that's good. That explains that, right? Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. That explains it. Yes, yes. But then, okay, like, to... In my my own opinion, lah, HBL, there's the good side of it and then there's the negative side of it also, right? Yeah. Like, our... We celebrated Hari Raya last year at home mm. during the circuit breaker. Yeah. So, <laughs> a new way of communication, yes. Zoom, Teams. Yes. I mean, before that, like, who uses them yeah. as a, as a yes. platform to talk, right? Mm -hmm. We just meet face-to-face. -face. Mm -hmm. Now, with, with that, we had, we got no choice but to use that for, you know, our high rise celebrations mm -hmm. and all. So, it, it was a new thing. Initially, I thought, like, it wasn't that trusted, you see? Mm. Because the first, if, as you guys know, at the start, Zoom, one of the Zoom call was interrupted by some hackers and uh, all and spreading yeah, yeah, all this. Yeah. Yeah, explicit contents and all. Mm. But then, we got no choice but to use Zoom and Teams during our high Raya celebration, mm -hmm. right? And then, by that point of time, we didn't know each other yet. Lah. If not, I would Zoom, call him and eat yeah. rendang, lontong, just right in front of him, mm -hmm. right? Mukbang, yes. yeah. Yeah, <laughs> mukbang, yes. Yeah. <laughs> mukbang, next episode, yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's fine. Hmm. But then, HBL, would you want to go through it again? Um, HBL, okay. The... HBL, like, if let's say it's just, like, full-on HBL semester, yeah, I would not do that again. But, like, if it's, like, SEM 2, for example, yeah. where we actually came to school, some subjects were HBL, some subjects were, like, you actually get to meet your friends. I like alternate weeks lah. Yeah, that was, like, completely, f that was fun. You know, you get to rest. You still get the, those days to just rest at home. Then other days, you can actually see your friends and things like that. So that was, that was, a, that was a cool concept, you know? The alternate weeks of HBL and face-to-face -face lessons. Yeah, right? that was fun. Yeah. So you're okay with having HBL, right? Just That's like, what you're trying to say, right? Like so it's not it's not home based hell, right? No. Right. Um. Okay. Let me get it straight. <coughs> so um, it was HB hell to me mm -hmm. because of the like full on HBL. It's not just the fact that we had to be at home to do schoolwork because mm -hmm. we we already had the opportunity to do schoolwork at home like you know e-learning day back in primary school oh, yeah secondary school yeah i was fine with that you know like the concept of just studying at home is completely okay with me yeah. but like having the whole semester just be online and then like if let's say you don't have great internet connection or if let's say you get a really like 
bad teacher or if let's say this teacher always forces you to turn on your camera mm, that teacher yeah, then mm, one teacher mm, like, don't want to name you know like that's the next next following podcast yeah so and then, tuned, like, right? you know there are some teachers they are really oh you can follow me or Shabil on Instagram no. then we can we can <laughs> tell you who's the teacher is. the random yeah shout outs yeah so there's this teacher mm, who's give really a shout out come yeah, carry on yeah. what's your Instagram username um at sy.riz Mm, you're fun then I R F A N <laughs> underscore D A N. Yeah. Okay. Back to back to back yeah, to yeah. back to the podcast. <laughs> so this teacher, okay, there's this teacher who was very impatient. <gasps> okay, yeah, she was very impatient. No names will be said. Okay, she really. Tell the my tongue to just say you know. no. No, no. We'll, we'll, like, we'll like get kicked out of this course. Yeah. Okay. okay. <laughs> so, so this teacher would like would be extremely angry if attendance taking takes more than like. Three minutes. Mm-hmm. She'll be enraged. Your face is not there within 10 seconds. Gone. You're not present. Yeah. So that was one thing I didn't like is that if some teachers were really impatient because not everybody has good internet connection at home. Oh yeah, that's one of the problems, right? Yeah, and then like some people's audios, maybe not everyone has like AirPods. Yeah. Maybe they bought like some... Because we must keep in mind mm. by like it's everyone's at home. Yeah. Even my dad is gonna be mm. outside mm-hmm. using the laptop. My sister is gonna be outside. Mm-hmm. Then we have my mother cooking. Mm-hmm. So it's just gonna be a grand, 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 grand. Mm. Um, listening, listening. Mm. You see, correct. Yes. That's one of another issue, right? Mm-hmm. And then internet connections. Mm-hmm. What else? Um, Any other? I, w- I wouldn't say it's a problem, lah. Maybe it's just a, a side, a side issue. A bit. It's, it's, it's like a, a small, issue. Yeah, it's, it's a, a mini issue. issue. Yeah. Um, don't call it a problem it's not yeah, a problem it's, right? it's, it's not, not that big of a deal okay not, yeah. yeah then um, oh there's actually more assignments that they'll give you oh, yeah, when true. you're in HBL because mm. like you can you, you have a book with you so yeah. they will not give you like 40% test yeah. if it were to be like face to face they'll give you like 5 5% test right yeah. yeah so it's like so there'll be like so many more assignments which sometimes is very hard to keep keep up with so yeah that's something I really didn't like yeah so it's Home-based hell or home-based learning? Um, I'd still say hell. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So. But I mean, we don't know what to expect for our our year two, right? Mm, the, Whether it's gonna be home-based learning or. or HB hell. I yeah. I got a feeling it's gonna be HB hell. Yeah. Got chance. Okay. And then that in mind mm-hmm. means I have to make new friends because mm. we are all separated from. Our classes. Mm, unfortunately, yeah, yes, that. that's a problem for me as an introvert, mm. but not for you. Hey, four of my classmates are here. So, like, hi guys, <laughs> hi. Okay, yeah. in context, lah, right? Context. Okay, mm-hmm. Shabil has a few of our classmates in his upcoming class. Mm-hmm. For me, it's just two or three, and I think that's gonna be a problem for me because mm. I don't speak to people like randomly, just like, hey, hi, hi, no, no, no. Mm. As an introvert, this is just gonna be me, just like. Mm. You, can ask, you can ask him. Yeah, it, right. it really was him. I actually sat beside him on the first face-to-face class. Like, like go, give me an impression of Daniel. Go. Yeah. Yeah, so basically, that's, that's my impression. <laughs> Shelby will be like, hey, hi, hi, hi. Yeah. What are you doing? Oh, this, 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 this. Daniel will be like... Yeah, he was, he, okay, he yeah. was actually right beside me. And I was talking to everybody else in this area. And he was yeah. like right beside me. And, okay, yeah, I... Yeah, he really just doesn't talk. Doesn't but why talk. didn't you want to talk to me? Why, why? I don't know. I felt like you were you were really in the zone. You looked very serious with school. I thought you also had that four point or nothing yeah. mentality. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. So I mine, mine was. I think it's just a three point five uh, kind of thing. I see, like I go see. with the flow. Three point five. Mm, yeah. That's, that's good. That's good. Yeah. yeah that's good. Four point oh. I mean, I'll just it's, leave it to you, lah. Four point oh. It's the goal. Yeah. 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 So that's why I didn't really like talk to you as much. But yeah, everybody else was like really... But then we, we did like talk to each other mm. in year 8 in SEM 2 because we started yes. hanging out, going yeah. out for we lunch, projects, together, projects yeah. together, yeah. Yeah, so that was, that, was, that was a fun time. Fun time, right, yeah. Yeah, okay. So, if let's say you could rewind time and give advice to <gasps> yourself before HBL started. So like, you go back to um, March, March, Daniel. Yeah. And be like, Hey, March Daniel, I've got some tips and tricks and some advice to give you. What For the upcoming HP? Hell. Hell, hell, yeah. Hell, yeah. The HP hell that's upon us. 
Yeah, then you can give like an advice. What what would the advice be? The advice be just boy, you got to be disciplined. Mm. Put this thing away. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Because this thing is just not gonna help me. Mm. I'm just distracted because it's just a screen. You see, just a screen. Then the teacher talking just no 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 no. No one's gonna be telling me then a look then a look unless I'm called out mm -hmm. for a question. So the whole time I'm just gonna be sitting like that. My phone. Yes. Right. So discipline, that's one of the, the, the main issue la, for me. How about you, Mr. Shabil or AKA Abil? Okay, so for me, if I could give that Or advice. AKA Mr. Managing Editor. Oh, thanks, thanks. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> thanks. Um, if I could give advice to um, March Shabil, okay? The one who really had high expectations of year one. The um, four point oh goal la. It was yeah, just four point oh, four point oh, four point oh. To yeah. um calm down, calm down, okay, um and not really um you know be too overconfident. That's one thing. Yeah. Cause like I really came into like year one, I was like the teachers like anybody has um Danny Con before. I was like mm, me, <laughs> I've done this. This is my subject. Yeah, I should I shouldn't have done that. Yep. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have had high expectations. Um and also I shouldn't have been complacent. That's one thing. Yeah, I felt like I was Listen, like, on? On what? Because I felt like I was like, oh, okay, I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. Oh, I know exactly what's going on. Oh, okay, this topic, done that, been there. And then I started to like slack off. Because you did that in PFP, right? Yeah. And I did pretty well for these types of topics. So I was like, okay, time to slack. Yeah. And then, you know, things started going south. When I start, I was like, eh? Yesterday got submission. Alamak. You know, like, eh, eh. Now after that, like, when you go back to the rubrics, like, oh, late submission will not be entertained. I was like, wait, did I just lose 30%? Wait, yeah. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Or seeing the notification on Teams, mm. you have not submitted your assignment yet. Yeah, I, I, I literally was, I remember the submission. That was that even I, scarier than taking my results. Right. Or doing all levels, yeah, yeah. Right, I was like, it's just, it was so scary. Oh, yeah. No, no. Because the thing is, my teacher didn't call me, you know. My teacher was not like, you know, the, you know, was not like Miss He, Saving Grace, you know. She would call You gotta people. beat that, yeah. Yeah. Be no, no, no. Miss He is great. Miss He is like, she will call you. She'll be like, hey, hey, King. Oh. Have you submitted your work? Oh, no? Oh, okay. Do that. Yeah. I had no idea. My work was already done. It was done actually three weeks before submission day. Yeah, I know. You, I you, like, you were done with your work like five weeks for BTA. You said that you wanted yeah. to submit that. Yeah. Stop. Yeah. I was no, I was done with POM like weeks ago. I didn't yeah. I didn't even remember the deadline because I was like, oh wait, the deadline is not next week. It was like apparently like in the mid of like towards the end of the semester. So I just like completely forgot about it. Because in, in your mind it was just 4.0, 4.0, 4 Yeah, 4 in my mind I was like, yeah. okay, this thing is done. So yeah. why do I touch it? And then after that when I saw, I was like, you know, I was like, you know, lazy. I was like bored. So I just like went through the like rubrics and the assignments that we had to submit. Then I realized like, wait! I haven't submit, yeah. Time. Then I was like, then instant breakdown. Then and there. I was like, oh my god, I did not submit a 30% assignment. Then I messaged the teacher. I was like, hi, I forgot to submit. And then I gave like a really long text. It's like, I'm really sorry. I was like, this will never happen again. It's, it's, it's once in, it's once. I'll never do it again. And then he was My just hopes like, and dreams of 4.0 yeah, is just down the drain. No, no. I, like I, that. I was really, I was like, I was crying like three days straight because of missing the assignment. I was like, I was, I literally went downstairs. I was like, you know what? I need fresh air. And I just started crying. I was like, oh my God, my parents are going to disown me. I was like, this Why are you going out of the house, yeah? Why? It's because a keep breaker, you, know? you should be I know, staying at home, I, was you know? like, I needed a drink, you know, I was very dehydrated from all the crying. So I was like, I needed a drink. Then mm. I was like, I was still crying, you know, when I downstairs. Crying, yeah, I Is your like, mask on, huh? Yeah, like, no one, no one could see me though. Yeah. So like, it's perfect time to cry. So I was like, oh my god, I cannot believe I missed the 30% assignment. I was just like thinking, like, oh my god, my parents, you know, like, I'm out of school, 1.0 GPA, here yeah. I come. Yeah, and then... Yeah, but the weird thing was that I didn't actually get penalized for the elite assignment. Weird, right? Weird. That was very weird. That was very weird. Cause I remember that some of my friends who like some like back in PFP. That's biased. That wasn't biased. I found out that a lot of people also didn't submit because it wasn't very like put out there that hey, this submission is due this day. Is it? They made it like really like sneaky. They were like really quiet. They're like, hey guys, submission today. Yeah. 
So that was the issue. So blame management, not me. <laughs> blame management, not not blame, you, lah. Yeah, don't blame. Yeah, it's yeah, not my actually. fault. It's not my fault for slacking. It's your fault for not reminding me. So yeah, that's the advice, lah. Huh? Yeah, mm. my advice is to not slack and not, you know, don't slack. Um, don't spend too much time on TikTok. You can spend like four to like eight hours. I know. TikTok. I mean, just now we were eating and you were dancing, right? You, yeah, of course. Was, yeah. I'm Addison Rae. Yeah. Did you guys know? I'm like literally Addison Rae. Okay. That's Maybe you should start TikTok, right? You should I start should. recording videos. I actually should. I think I could be like... Comment down video. below if you want us to do TikTok <laughs> videos. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. yeah, maybe I should. I could be the next like Charlie D'Amelio of yeah. Singapore. I think I can, sir. Yeah. Like, okay. I can have my own reality show. Can you imagine how fun that would be? Yes. Like my own reality show. Yeah. Then my own like makeup line. Your own branding. Yeah. Abil. Not Shabil. Abil. Oh my god. That's that's a good idea. I, yeah. think, I think I'll be a full-fledged TikToker right after this. Yes. I think that's my calling. You guys agree? You guys agree? I think right. everybody here agrees that I should be a TikToker. Yeah, yeah. Maybe we can monetize that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll take 20% of it. Uh, yeah, right. I'll take 20%. Yeah. Yeah, you'll be my manager. Yes. Twenty yeah. percent of it is mine. Oh, yeah, that's but you still have to pay me, though. Twenty percent is just twenty <laughs> percent is just thing, like you know? the yeah. side thing. Like your standard yeah, pay is yeah, still yeah. like ten k. Make that fifteen. Uh, fifteen. Oh, okay. Okay. Not yeah. bad. Not bad. Quite reasonable. I mean, I can be your bodyguard also, right? Uh, <laughs> I guess. Yeah. Um, sure. Name it. <laughs> Driver, bodyguard, what? Chef? Mm, you can cook. Manage? Sure. Oh. What you want to eat? <laughs> wow. Name me Indomie, Maggie, what? Whoa. He's talented. Yes. He's talented. He's yes. He's not just like a host. Yes. He is. He's yes. talented. You should join CCM. I think you're in the wrong course. No, I mean... No, no, no. Nah. I think I think Indomie is like really a hard skill. Very, bro. It's really hard. Like, Very. I've tried it before. Very. I burnt the... I almost burnt the house down. Yeah. Oh, oh. Stay tuned for that. Next <laughs> podcast, yeah? Yeah, that, yeah. The Never Again, the next episode for yeah. Never Again will probably be Never Again Making Indomie. Yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. That's really interesting. Yeah. So, remember. Okay. So After Polly. My new, my new career. Yeah. Career path. I'll be a TikToker. You want to show us any one of the dances now? Yeah. Me? Zoom in, zoom in to him, yeah. Zoom in, yeah. Okay. You know what? That's for the Me. next episode. So, thank you guys so much for listening to today's podcast, the brand new Stories and Co podcast. If you really did enjoy listening to us, you can um, tune in next week. We won't know who's the special guest. We don't know what's the topic, but I'm pretty sure it'll be fun and fresh. And you can also watch the video for this on our YouTube channel. And that would be Stories & Co. on YouTube. Thank you so much for listening. Bye.